Good morning and happy Monday. Today I'll be working from home and also going to the library. This will be my last week of work, but most of the undergrads have already had their end of term, so most of Oxford will be quite empty, so I wanted to make full use of that and to get a nice spot in some of the Pauline libraries. I'm just gonna do a quick workout. Sorry, this is a bit of an odd angle, but yesterday I went to collect these dumbbell sets. They are detachable and also like adjustable with weight. So here are some of the other weights and more over there as well. I was actually meaning to buy this on Black Friday but thank goodness I didn't because someone from my department was moving out and they posted in the WhatsApp group chat and I managed to get all of this for like 25 pounds and normally it'd be like 80 or 90 so I'm very happy about that. <laughs> I still can't figure out how to do a pseudo bulk PCA. So yeah, I need another coffee. I've been trying to run my pseudo bulk PCA analysis for the past two plus hours and I'm back at square one. Um supposed to go to the library, but I feel like it might be a bit packed now, so I'm just gonna eat some lunch and then head out later in the evening. p.m. I've lit up a candle which I bought the other day. It's malt wine scented so very on theme and I set up this whole cozy thing to try and motivate myself to at least do another hour of work to try and put together a few slides with some of the data that I found um, so I can show my supervisors tomorrow and to just try to wrap things up before the holiday season so I can fully enjoy my holiday without needing to think of my PhD project. I did not realize that I've been making slides till midnight, but I'm pretty much there and I'll just do the remaining and final touch-ups tomorrow. It's been a long day in the office. I had a two-hour meeting with 
my supervisors. One of them is a computational biologist and the other is a clinician. So I was just presenting to them some of the analysis that I've done. I've got a lot of things to do from that. Oops. This is a massive treat for myself. It is a 9-in-1 pen that I got from John Lewis because when I left my previous job at a biotech company in Cambridge, my colleagues gave me a 110 or 120 pound voucher that I could spend on and I've been thinking about it for a really long time. So this is it and you can cook nine ways. Isn't it such a pretty blue color as well? Today, I am going to teach myself how to use QPath to analyze H&E slides. H&E is hematoxylin and eosin stain, which is commonly used for histopathology staining. I need to plan out my Xenium spatial transcriptomic experiment that is scheduled to run in January. And normally we fit a few different tissue samples, healthy, diseased, and at different time points. And we also have them from our uh, biobank, but also from other sources like the NHS and also one for collaborators in the US. I'm essentially trying to fit all of that into a slide. So it's kind of like an art project, but the thing is that there's hundreds and thousands of images to go through and they're not exactly organized. Yeah, and, I, and I'm not entirely sure where all of them are as, as well, so that's the tough part. So yeah, today will mostly be just going through everything that the lab has had in the past couple of years and trying to pick the best samples for my project. <laughs> plan to go to the library today but I thought that I definitely needed a big monitor to be going through these different folders so just in case I couldn't get um, a good seat at the library I'd rather be doing this at home. Uh, it's been a very long day but I guess it's better than having no data at all which means that I can't run any experiments so I made myself some black sesame tang yuan in ginger brown sugar soup. So I'm gonna have that whilst I go through many, many hundreds more images. I didn't vlog for the whole of the tip today because I literally only woke up at like 11, then went for my run, and I'm fully only starting my work day at 2.
Cause you, baby, know you'll catch me whenever I fall I fall It's like my lace is untied Got me tripping right into your arms Your arms Headed straight down Through the night clouds So is my heart pounds Ten thousand feet between my parents You, baby, know you'll catch me whenever I fall Butterfly feeling edge of a cliff 